Okay, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video and today we are back with FNAF Tower Defense and I'm going to be teaching you guys the fastest way that you guys can go and rack up some gold because I found that after the latest update, gold has been very easy to get. I don't know if I'm doing something differently or if, you know, they actually change something, but I'm just getting gold really, really fast. Like since last video, I know my gold didn't go up by a lot because, but I actually, it did go up because I did spend it a lot on summoning for a certain video that might be coming out later and now i'm back to 53k which is good but my point is this is very easy so i'm going to be showing you guys the fastest ways that i think about getting gold but before that i want to bless you guys up with the best image you've seen today all right and then i want you guys to comment down below rating this image on a one to ten of how much you like it right are you ready three two one there you go okay that's it that's all you're getting you're getting it that fast rate it down below but anyways let's go ahead and get straight to the video because i know that you guys need the gold because spring trap i mean purple guy is gonna be dropping and he's gonna be cost gold so of course I'm, I'm not even gonna spend too much time on this this is pretty obvious make sure you guys try to complete the index because obviously the more units you get the more gold you get but now that i got that out of the way you guys think i might be talking about endless but low key I'm, I know, I know they revamped Endless, and I know that it does give you a lot of coins, and honestly, it might be one of the best ways for you to get coins, Endless, but I just find myself getting so bored playing Endless, I don't know, even though the method I'm going to show you guys, I just do the same thing over and over again, I find myself so bored playing Endless, like, it's mostly I have a video on the side, and I'm just waiting to get enough cash to upgrade the units, I don't know, I get so bored playing Endless, the best, best, best way for you to get gold if you want to actually have fun playing the game at least in my opinion okay obviously if you don't mind and you don't think it's boring playing endless by all means play endless because it might give you a little bit more gold than what i'm going to show you here obviously it depends so it, it's mostly up to preference okay the, don't come dissing me in the comments down below but also if you guys have any fun video ideas comment down below because i feel like i've been doing a lot of these videos like how to get souls how to get coins and leaks blah blah blah, blah. i also want to bring in some fun videos like i don't know bonnie units only or something what i like to do is i like to just play over here let's try to do this so game three night two uh, i think we can do nightmare let's try to do nightmare on this and then let's see how much coins we are going to get from this one match i'm also going to time it how much how long it's going to take so as soon as we load in i'm going to start timing it so 223 of this video is when it started so minute 223 let's go ahead and already start down with some spring traps or spring bonnies whatever you want to call them but we'll place them down right here. And I oh, I can already upgrade them. Okay. I'm not even going to pause the video so you guys know that I'm not cutting anything. So that we can see exactly how long it's going to take. How much health do they have? Uh, does that say? Oh, 15,000. Oh. Okay. Maybe maybe I wasn't, I wasn't expecting that much. But we'll be able to upgrade them. I think. I think. We'll place down a couple uh, Freddos just to help out. Because, you know, it's never it's never too... too Okay. Okay. I don't think we can do this. I don't think we can do this. Actually, we might. I think we can take a couple hits. I'm going to try to go ahead and place down my... Uh, maybe if we did not have skip on, I think we're cooked. I'm like 90% sure we're cooked. Unless you can go right now and place down the, the, this. Please. Yeah, no, we're cooked. Yeah, we're cooked. Okay. So let's, 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 maybe, let's maybe redo this on hard mode because um, I, I wasn't expecting it to be this hard. But hey, we got 25 coins, okay? I just randomly had this idea guys, but how would you guys like to see a noob to pro series? I've been thinking about doing that in my channel for a while now, like in all the games I've ever recorded, but I never actually did it. What if FNAF 2D was the first game I dropped a uh, noob to pro series? Would you guys be into that? Do you guys want me to do a noob to pro? Or nah, you know, not something you guys would watch. Let me know in the comments down below, because if you guys think that's cool, I'll go on my in an alt account and I will do that. How much health do they have now? Oh, 9k, okay, a lot easier. Why is he going this way, bro? Why are both of them going this way? Come on, bro. But they're spawning in kind of fast, actually. So that's good. I'm going to upgrade both of them, actually, while we're at it. And they can spin this one again. Please. Okay, maxed out one of them. And then max out the other. Can I please place this one now? Okay, there we go. Place this down and then max this one out. Please. Please max out these really quickly and then now we should be good now we should be good oh, yo 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 scott scott okay all right we're good we're good we're good we're good we place them all down now they're coming in with a thousand health we are chilling that's all we have to do we just the, the part that we struggle is this beginning over here and then after that we're chilling we don't need to worry about nothing anymore place that down place the freddos down now we can place down a nightmare over here to do aoe damage to everybody 
Probably could have placed him a little bit more over here because his range is bigger. But whatever. Look at that. Does damage to everybody in the range. Look at that. Such a good unit, bro. I like the Nightmare. You guys never let... Uh, I mean, you guys did. A lot of people commented that you guys like Nightmare. I remember before I got Nightmare, some of you guys were commenting that he wasn't that good. And I low-key got upset because I was like, no way. I really want him to be good. And I really like him. I don't know why some people were saying he's bad. If you think he's a bad unit, please comment down below and let me know why do you think that Nightmare is a bad unit in the game. Anyways, max out this Nightmare. And then I'll place down another one. Bloop, 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 bloop. Come on, and just a little bit more, please, quickly. And I see this is maybe I'm now starting to wonder should I have started with Nightmare? How much is his um, starting damage? I maybe should I have start? I think maybe I should have started. No, because he's 10k. Never mind. I couldn't even if I wanted to. Maybe I, I could have taken the first few hits, maybe, I don't know. But there we go, max out the Nightmare, we got everybody placed down over here. So now we're just missing the Spring Traps, obviously. Always take forever to place down and max out, but I mean, obviously it's a very good unit. So, can't make him too cheap, or else, you know, that's too OP. Does he reach over here? No, he does not, barely. But I think he will reach it by the time he's maxed out. Just a little bit more. There we go, now he's reaching over here. It's gonna make things a lot faster. I'm gonna place down another spring trap right here. 20k. What's the most expensive unit in this game? Now I'm kind of curious. Does anybody know over there what's the most expensive? Uh, not to max out. I mean, to place down. Is spring trap? No, because there is Hydra. Hydra is also 20k. So is there a unit that goes past 20k that I'm not remembering right now? But there we go. Place these over here. And then I'll just place down another spring trap. Oh no, we gotta place down two. Okay. Can I place down everybody? I did place down everybody. Okay, and then now we just wait. And there we go. See, if it's insane mode, I could max this out so quickly like I did. Maybe it would have been better. Maybe it's I should have done that. Toxic cupcake. And then let's see how fast he leaves. And let's see how much coins we are going to end up getting from it. But get rid of him very quickly. Come on, uh, Nightmares. Do something. Maybe I should move. Uh, I'll, move I'll move with Scott back here so we can move a little bit faster. Uh, Scott. Oh my god, I thought I sold him. Scott. There we go. And then these are also boss killers. So. There we go. We got 1k gold from this. How much? How long did it take us? Like, what? Like, three minutes? Four minutes? We got 1k gold. I mean, you can get a really good amount of gold from endless mode, especially with the new addition. And you get presents and whatever. So I feel like it's still worth it for you to do endless mode more than this method. But I low-key like this method more. I don't know. I just get so bored playing endless mode. I don't even... I couldn't even tell you why. Because, I mean... This, I'm also just doing the same thing over and over again, but for some reason, I just don't get as bored as Endless Mode. I don't know, guys. But anyways, like I said, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys have any other video ideas, please, please, please let me know. That's going to be it for this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.